This is demonstration of cardioversion using the Life Pack 20. Number one is to turn on your defibrillator. Connect electrodes. Number two will be to connect the quick combo pads to the patient's chest using either position, the anterior lateral or the anterior posterior positions for the pads, depending on the size of the patient's chest. For cardioversion, the patient needs to be connected to the three lead Connect EKG electrodes. leads that are on the live pack as well as the quick combo pads. We want to use cardioversion energy joules of 0.5 joules per kg. Our patient weighs 10 joules, so we're going to start our cardioversion at 5 joules. We want to select lead 2 to monitor this patient in. And you can see that the rhythm is SVT. For cardioversion, we want to press the sync button on the, the defibrillator. And you'll see an annotated mark above each QRS. So step three, we'll charge the defibrillator. An audio alarm will cue you when you have energy um, ready. You'll clear the patient. I'm clear. Your clear oxygen is clear. And in this case, when you depress the the charge, when you depress the energy button, you'll press and you'll hold until the energy is released. We'll go back to en number two, energy select, and we're select. We've we have five joules selected. We'll charge the defibrillator. For this cardioversion, if the Connect first cardioversion is unsuccessful, we'll, we'll select one joule per kg, which will be 10 joules. We'll charge the defibrillator. We'll clear the patient. I'm clear. You're clear. Oxygen is clear. We'll depress the energy button. We'll depress it and hold until we see the energy being released. and a normal sinus rhythm has been achieved. Once the energy has been depressed in cardioversion, the sync button goes off and it goes back to a defibrillation mode in the event that the rhythm goes into a defibrillation or a VTAC dysrhythmia, then you can immediately move to a defibrillation.